Good evening, some guy dude here. Welcome back to Let's Play Alchemia. The game has started to ramp up the just ramp up the intensity. And I am excited. Now I have a key to a locker. I don't remember any lockers from the other floors, so I'm gonna I'm gonna te okay, that texture thing's weird. Wait a minute, what did wait, 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 wait. What did that note say on the first floor? There was a note that mentioned that on the first floor. So let's recheck that. I, I like how I gasp when I run. Like, okay, there's a weird something that's happening with, um... Not with my running, but with just moving the camera around. It seems like now and again, that kind of bugs out. And everything goes every which way. Okay. What did that damn note? This this note here. Not no no not not that one. Not that one. Not that one. I think it was this this it was this one. The third story floor is now in need of critical repair. Access to the stairs is prohibited. If there's an urgent need to use the stairs, then the key can either be found with the construction team or with the doctors. I don't recommend using the stairs unless it's absolutely necessary. So I've got... a key... Maybe, maybe the second floor will have a locker in it that's something I can use. I will say, I am tense right now. I'm very tense, and I love it. I don't love it, I hate it. Second floor looks like the third floor. Oh my! Okay then. The riddle of rooms is very simple. You will solve it certain. Oh good. So there's that there. Mm. These sounds are excellent. Very eerie indeed. <laughs> Excuse me? Room of Death 1? I don't want the Room of Death. There's something behind the strange behind the glass. Yes! Yes, there is. That is a little peculiar, I will admit. I can't quite put my finger on it. But something seems off in that general vicinity. Can I get in there? Wait. I do keep running into lockers. Operation room. Whoa, 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 give it. This place. Looks all too familiar. I used to be here a long time ago. This is the hospital. Finally figured out that this is the hospital. Excellent job, my friend. Save point. Hey look, lockers! Now it's open. Booyah! Booyah! What's that? Hi, Lisa. Dr. Kaufman has ordered the installation of a code panel on the door to the operation room. What I can't understand is what does he want it for? Well, whatever. It's not important. If you forget the password, it consists of four digits. Funny enough, each dig digit seems to respond to the product of the first and third... Each digit seems to correspond to the product of the first and third digit in the numbers of the f of four different rooms. Uh. TV in the first room, patient with a heart condition in the second room, a little girl in the third room, and the fourth room I hate because the occupant is a cranky drunk. Good luck. TV, heart condition, little girl, drunk. Uh. <sighs> I 
I know how I have to solve this. I just don't want to do it. Oh, this is gonna s that's gonna be terrible. Bathrooms. Oh, I hope they're all just right here. Oh, heart condition. Okay. So that's a heart- that's our heart condition. Okay, go oh good. I had this bad feeling I was gonna have to be like, meandering from... room to room. TV in the first. What's this? The doctor said I can go home soon. Thank God. To me, it's horrible here. I don't like this hospital. The food's terrible. Compared to a <coughs> compared to a home-cooked meal, this is just shit. Even fast food is starting to sound good. Besides, there's absolutely nothing to do here. This room is simply awful, I, th I though it wouldn't be if they just fixed it. Truth is, on the third floor, the repair work is already being done. From what I hear, the ceiling in room 302 has collapsed and crushed one of the patients. Apparently, one of the doctors found him and he's now in the morgue. At least that's what I heard. I haven't seen it for myself. Don't worry, I'll be home soon. Bill. Bill the cranky drunk. So I'm assuming the fourth the fourth room is the little girl room. But of course I'm going to have to look into the little girl room because I can't just know that it's the little girl room. Oh. Whoa. Oh. Okay. Alright. They are not humans, they all want to kill me. Okay. If you don't mind, I'll be, uh, I'll be heading out. Got some things to do. Gotta remember our first room has a TV. Second room had a heart patient. Third room had a cranky drunk. Fourth room had a girl in it. So, four, two, six, eight. Four, two, six, eight. We're gonna try four, two, six, eight. stuck. A lot of circuitous paths. I'm gonna check one more, check my thing one more time. TV, yeah. Because the TV was the second door. Heart was the first thing I found. Little girl was at the end. Fourth room was a cranky drive. Oh, so it's four, two, eight, six. Glad we checked that. 4286. If I'm... If I'm interpreting that right. Oh, come on. Wait, was that to the operations room? Did I get that... The product of the first and third digit in the numbers of four different rooms. Two thousand years later. TV in the first room, so that'd be 202. Patient with a heart condition is in the second room, 201. Little girl in the third room, that might be 301. So it'd be four, two, blank, six. Four, two, blank, six. Nurse is gone, 301. 301. I was right. Clearly a little girl's room. There's a baby doll and a teddy bear in it. Right? That was 202. Product of the first and third digit is 4. Patient with a heart condition in the second room. That was 201. 2 times 2 is 2. There's a little girl in the third room. 301. 313. And the fourth room I hate because the occupant is a cranky drunk. That was 203. Ergo six, four, two, three, six. All right, I'm the idiot. I interpreted room two o three as being a cranky drunk because his letter that he wrote sounded really grumpy. Well, there's another room that I forgot about that actually has alcohol in it. I forgot about that. 
Ugh. That was an ordeal. That was painful. Four, two, three, nine. Oh, of course. Of course, yeah, that just bonks right open. Okay. Well. Scream, scream. Some stuff. Oh, man. And things are getting dark. Like, darker than usual. Not usual. Darker than before. Just in all senses. Now, before we keep going, there is a safe in one of the rooms on the third floor. Third floor? Yeah. There's a safe... And there's also the door in the basement. So there's two there's two things still still yet to unlock. Some busted TVs. Room of Life 35. Whoa. What is all this stuff? Okay. There's so much blood. Was there a surgery recently? <laughs> there's it's blood. I hope this is not Chris's blood. Well... Room of Life 35. Okay. What do I do about that? Can I really, uh... Can't really interact with anything in here. I mean, it's very eerie. That was some spooky stuff, but... There was nothing actually to... There wasn't a note? There's... There's footprints. That's kind of a cool touch. They just sort of stop here. The vent. You got something for me, game? You wanna hand me something? Give me a... Damn, I got some, like, Freddy Krueger arms going here. Well, okay. So I just opened the operating room. What? what? <laughs> Why did I open the operating room? Room of Life 35. Alright, I'm gonna have to do a very quick whip through of all the rooms. Because I just remembered something. This is okay. <laughs> Room of Life 35. Room of Death 1. There's Room of Life 35. Room of Death 1. Yeah, alright. Room of Old Age 4. Room of Birth 4. Okay, okay. I have a thought. I have a thought. Because th we that's our life- we just got our life cycle. That was a life cycle. Damn it! What's the- oh, it's this way. Because that was... Birth... Birth, life, old age, death. Right? If I'm right, which I'm, I'm usually close to right. That's my, that is my style. I'm never quite right. I'm usually almost right. Because what I would assume, it would go birth, life, old age, death. Which would be four, it would be, be four, one, Four, three, five. I'm losing my mind. I am losing my mind. I cannot figure this out. I'm going to every room a second time. I'm going into every room to see if there's like, maybe there was a fifth one that I didn't notice. Room, old age, adolescence. You know, birth. You know, birth. Maybe there's a maybe there's a room of youth that I didn't spy. 
I've been going- I've just been going into every room and looking at every wall. Just doing one of these. Call Bill Thursday. My knee is giddy. Room of birth was four. Room of life was one. Room of old age was four. Room of death was 35. <sighs> life begins at birth. Li life, birth, life, death, old age. Maybe it's like a, maybe, maybe it's doing it like, like, <laughs> like college SAT format. So, four, four, one, four, three, five. Nope. One, four, three, five, four? That didn't make sense! That didn't make sense. That's what it was. It was college SAT. It was li life begins at birth, death Begins at old age? I don't. That. Alright. DL. So that's gonna be either that one locked room here. No. There was a locked room on the third floor and there was a doctor. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna. I'm gonna th assume. I'm gonna try the doctor's room first. Actually, no, no. We're gonna try the. Actually, you know what we're gonna do? We're gonna pause the episode in the elevator, because I'm tired, I'm annoyed. That was a lot of effort to get this, so. Alright, Alchemy. Still a good game, I'm not gonna shit on the game for a poorly thought out riddle. I did- I moved that. I ran into that with Enola, I'm not gonna dip into that well again. Link in the description, check it out, it really is worth it. Um, my link to my Twitter in there as well. Hit the like button if you enjoy. Seriously, please do. Comment and subscribe if you feel like it. Check out some of the other stuff I've done. And until next time, SGD out.